Diaz Emerson, good morning to you. Okay, we're gonna be doing a new design today using our hand. So live long and prosper, I love you. And we're also gonna use some of our shapes. I wanna do it on a big paper. I'm just feeling like I wanna do like a poster size one. Whatever size paper you have is fine. I found uh, this weird piece of paper that was going to be thrown out and I was like, oh, that's a nice white piece of paper. I think I'll use that. Um, on the back, I am going to measure a giant circle, which just happens to be I have this giant circle. Uh, you can always use a paper plate or a regular plate, anything you got. I need my pencils, so let me get out my art kit. Great. Here's the stuff. I'm gonna be using a circle today. Maybe I'll use the rectangle. Uh, I'm gonna be using my pencils today. And maybe I'll use my Sharpies too. Um, I wanna use a scissors today. So here's my scissors. And if you're lucky enough to have glue and tape, great, and look at the shape. Hey! <laughs> Gotta grab the scissors. Do you want me to? Yeah, sorry about that. Um, okay. <laughs> and uh, here's my triangle that I'm so pleased with. Okay. Lots of tools. Okay, where is that? Yeah, this should do. I want a big circle. Why are you doing it in pencil, Miss Mina? Draw a light until you know it's right. And then go darker or trace with marker. So here we go again. Now I'm going to cut my circle out. Great. This should go in the trash. Where is the trash can? Okay. Uh, on we go. I'm going to fold this in half because I want to figure out where the middle point is. I'm just going to use these creases as a marker. I just want to find out where the middle of the paper is. So if I fold it in half twice, this is going to be the middle. Do you remember how we made the heart shape using our hand? We kind of did that nanu nanu and then like this. I want to do the heart shape again. I'm going to use some colored paper. I sincerely hope you've got a little colored paper, maybe some construction paper. I have this printer paper, which it's Ms. Magenta popping in to say that when you're doing this project, if you don't have colored paper or construction paper, that's totally fine. You can do this just as well with pencils, with pens, colored pencils, crayons, watercolor, paint, anything you want to use will make this project just as fabulous as if you had colored paper. So use what you got, do what you can. I cannot wait to see your projects. I miss you all so much. And back to Ms. Mina. So start with the fingers. Whoops. <laughs> that looks really bad. All right. <laughs> I'm going to make that into a beautiful heart. Hey, not quite right. Uh, students, I'm going to try again on the other side. Okay, here we go. Wow, wow. Miss Mina, you can do it. Here we go. Better. Uh, pretty good. Okay, let's let's work with it. I can work with that. Draw a light until you know it's right, and then go darker and trace with marker. I always say, okay, great. So I'm gonna erase some of those lines that I don't need anymore. <gasps> Oh, I might have to just do an extra decoration there. Wow, that's kind of bad. Okay, fix that. We'll fix it up somehow or other. Okay, here we go. That heart. Keep working with it. Okay, I might want to use some of this pink for part of the design, so I'm gonna keep that there. Okay, the heart's gonna go in the middle. 
The heart is used in Mexican uh, art a lot. You'll see the heart again and again and again. So it's good to have it in our art. I'm going to put a little glue on the back. Beautiful. And now I'm going to put hands on either side. So what other colors do I have? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Can I fit two hands on one paper? Yes. Great. Okay. Here we go. Uh, can you just edit some of this, <laughs> by the way? Because that's like the lamest thing I've ever seen. Excuse me. <sighs> Good. Okay. And have you noticed that it's hard to draw with one of your hands? I happen to be right-handed. My left hand doesn't draw very well. So I'll show you a secret to that. First of all, I'm going to cut out the hand. Nice. Okay. And because it's hard for me to draw with my left hand, I am going to draw another one and then just flip it over. Now, instead of having two left hands, I'm gonna have one left hand and one right hand. Because you flipped this one over. Yes. I wanna have um, an emoji, an emoji of love. Maybe two emojis of love. Okay. And, okay, I'm just gonna make the really happy emoji here. And this is gonna be the, the love eyes, if I can manage the love eyes, here we go. Okay, because I love you. Yay! Maybe a little black marker. Okay, I want to just do a couple of freeform type shapes, lines, maybe some lines with my leftover scraps here. You know, kind of like love radiating out from my heart. It's so beautiful. Now I have to glue it down. Oh, Emerson, I'm thinking of you. I love you so much. Now have fun. And what do we do with our art? Share it with the community. From the depths of the earth to the stars Light up the world, light up the world Run like you're born to fly Live like you'll never die Dare what you dare to dream And everything in between I had an epiphany one night Looking at the endless star-filled sky
get it right. That's okay.